This video is explanation of an oceanic biocube filtration system for a marine aquarium. So here is a 29 gallon oceanic biocube. Uh, you could tell the back top cover is propped up. You can see the lights, they're propped up against the wall. And as we move in closer, this is inside the tank. You have a lower intake and an upper intake vent. The water flows through these two vents. It goes into the back, into this area back here. Then it goes through this physical filter. And this is just uh, a screen with some activated carbon inside. And that activated carbon, you want to replace it every month. It just takes a yellow tinge out of the water to make your water clearer. So you want to replace that every month. Then the water flows from the screen into the area where the bio balls are. These are the bio balls. These bio balls basically just provides your tank with more filtration surface area. You'll have helpful bacteria that grow on these. They work with live rock to help filter ammonia from your system. Now, I'm going to be using live rock rubble in this system because I find it's a little bit more efficient at filtering. However, bio balls are excellent. They do a great job. You might want to clean them once every six months. You put them in a salt, fresh salt water bath and just sh shake them around to get rid of detritus. But you don't want to clean them with a brush or anything because that will get rid of the good beneficial bacteria that you have built up. So bio balls, these are great. You don't want to clean it all at once. You want to clean it a little bit at a time because you want the uh, marine environment, you want just want to make small changes to it. So maybe a handful of balls at a time, you might want to clean it and you clean it over time. So then the water goes through these bio balls. Goes to this area here where you can see there is a pump at the bottom, a water pump. It goes up through a hose. This is like a water pump impeller. And it gets sent back through your aquarium. So you want to you want to place the nozzle on this so that it sends the water from the front to the back in a circular motion. And that should be healthy for your marine environment. And that's the filtration system for a 29-gallon biocube.